If you depend on a Spartanburg City bus to get you to and from work, you may find yourself without a ride home. A driver shortage has caused some routes to be canceled, sometimes with very little notice. 7 News' Alessandra Young breaks down the impact. If you're a bus rider in the city of Spartanburg, your bus route might be changed some days due to a driver shortage. City officials say they try to update people a day or two in advance. With a shortage like this, sometimes that's just not possible. I've been, um, been riding every day most days for, for over 20 years. Philip Stone is a rider who has been impacted by the driver shortage. It's actually meant that some afternoons I have had to find an alternate way home. He says most days he has noticed the change earlier in the day. So it makes me think, well, I clearly have to find another way to get home today. Stone says if he can't catch the 515, then he has to rely on coworkers, friends, or walk. I, I actually don't drive. Okay. I'm too nearsighted to drive. Chris George with the city says they're having trouble filling some of their part time driver positions. And that's led to us having to on some days adjust our schedule and shorten hours and things like that. He says when schedules are changed, their most popular routes remain unaffected. We're tending to do it later in the day when we know we have fewer riders and also adjusting routes that may not have as many folks who depend on them. But that can leave riders like Stone searching for a lift. Normally the buses run Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. and Saturdays from 7 a.m. to 1 in the afternoon. What we've done is we've moved to the uh, Saturday schedule through the week and so we would shut down in the early afternoon. George says the city is talking about some incentives to help fill driver positions. In the meantime, it's encourage folks to try to be patient. We understand the frustration that folks are feeling who depend on the bus system. If you need to know whether your bus route has been changed or not, head on over to WSPA.com for all the ways you can find out. In Spartanburg, Alessandra Young, 7 News.